Chef Talk with Kyle Cherick is brought to you by the following presenting sponsors. Mandel and the North End. For more information on these or other supporting sponsors, please click on the banner ads to the right of the Chef Talk episodes for links directly to their websites. The Boulevardier. How long, how far back does this drink go? This is... A long time. This is... Um, uh, Dale de Groff, this is before then. Oh yeah, way before Not, then. I was thinking that Dale de Groff, the original, the original guy in the 1840s. This is... Yeah, uh, the, he was like a magazine guy. Yeah. French. He, you know who I mean. Basically mm-hmm. the grandfather of cocktails. The original Bo- Boulevardier. All right. That, my friend, is a bit of a stuffed bird in a ducky cage. It's a great place. So there should be a bit of a je ne sais Tycoon Sun Parisianness to this. Yes. I like it. Yes. I like it. Some people kind of, you know, shadow the Negroni and put an orange slice. I'm more of the mind where this is one of those kinds of drinks where it really doesn't need a garnish. Ice. Ice. Equal parts. Mm-hmm. That's how I do Stir. ours here. Yep. And, and then those equal parts are. One ounce, one ounce, and one ounce. Age before beauty and cocktails before lunch. Always. With Katie, Every day. With Katie Rose in the Boulevardier <laughs> at Bernhardt's <laughs> and Bourbon Air yes. Age Barrel. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. <laughs> On to the second cocktail. Moving right along. I'm going to actually do a comment. But there should be sweet and a sour and an acid and umami. I think all these things should exist. In, in a majority of drinks because I'm a, a, I am don't know, I like all of them. So our kind of semi-basic Collins recipe here. So what are you getting? You have to narrate. Getting some simple syrup and some fresh lemon juice. Nobody ever calls for complex syrup anymore. Not true. Take a look in that refrigerator. <laughs> <laughs> so just a little bit of sour, a little bit of sweet. Labels, labels forward. Please. Yeah. This one should be shaken. And just very simple. This is a great summer one. Soda. Little, little seltzer water. Seltzer water, and then do you finish and it with then, this crazy yep, thing? Just put a few drops on top just for the aromatics. Let me see if I have a lemon up here. That's a fine daytime, a respectable cocktail. Respectful cocktail. Yeah. Okay, so we are plumbing the Bernhardt's menu. What I would like to see, what I would like to this taste. This one is one of my favorites. Honey peach? This one. That's what I was going towards, yeah. afternoon in Old San Juan. So this is the perfect combination of like daiquiri meets pina colada all vacation. Wow. It's great. So that's rum yeah. that you soaked infused rather, yep. allspice with for how with long? Allspice with, it goes for about three days. So we've got a tempered glass, pint glass. Yep. Yep. Got some and of this. And this one's actually fairly easy. It's equal parts of a majority of these things. Lead us through what you're putting in. So that was the So coconut. we had the allspice rum, fresh lime, simple syrup, cream of coconut. And? This is sage liqueur. So say that by again. Art and the Age. Say again. Sage. sage. Wo- uh, this is, I, I really like Bitterman's products. This is their Imakule Tiki bitters. So this, again, kind of right. brings in that that particular flavor to that genre. I have a really good cannibal joke for you, by the way. We're done with this. What, you don't want to? The punchline is you can't boil them. They're fryers. <laughs> sure. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> All right. There we have it. Professional strainer. This one's so good. Afternoon in Old San Juan. Who are we kidding? That's a thing of beauty. That's like a field trip right there. (laughs) Straw, right? There we go. Yeah. That's a fine tropical drink. (laughs) That is. And throughout the whole process, I was thinking about Puerto Rico. You nailed it. This has got a little uh, to it. A little thickness. 
then there's this great little light note happening. Oh, yeah. oh, snappy rum thing. Oh, a little vacation. Three cocktail recipes with the great Katie Rose. And, um... It's been a real pleasure. Yeah, yeah. This is my favorite kind of cooking demo ever. <laughs> food? Who needs food? <laughs> Later, we're going to have a bag of chips. <laughs> yeah. And a beef jerky. And a beef jerky and finish these cocktails. <laughs>